Hey guys, thank you for joining me. Today we are going to create an application for Mac using Visual Studio for Mac. Okay, let's start. Okay, so actually Microsoft uh, created two applications. One is Visual Studio Code. We are not using this. We are using Visual Studio for Mac. Let's wait a moment for it to start. Usually we use a uh, Xcode for creating Mac application, but now we can use C Sharps to create Mac application using Visual Studio. That's quite cool. Okay, let's go and start a new solution. And I'm doing a Mac apps. Okay, Coco apps, and click on next. Let's call it Hello Mac Tree. So click next. Most of the things I'll just leave it as default. Create. So these are the files that has been generated for us. This is the storyboard, the interface, and we have our main code at viewcontroller.cs. It's a C sharp file, and this is a designer files. So actually, at storyboard here, it will load Xcode and we make changes using Xcode interface builders. All the changes will be saved and converted and changed and created for this designer.cs. Okay. Let's run it. Run and see what this application does. Okay, it created a basic windows for us. I'm going to make some changes as to create a button here and a label over here. So let's go to storyboard, double click it once. This is the Xcode interface builder. This is the windows the users are saying I need a button. Search for the button here. So I have a push button here, which I add over here. Let's give it a name. Uh, no, give it a text of hello. And I need a label. Create, add a label over here. So let me save it. Okay, I'm gonna close it. So when I go to this uh, Visual Studio. I'm going to run it again. They actually save all the changes over here. And I need to hook them up. Take a look at this designer.cs. Currently, it don't have much code, okay? Later, when I hook them up, you have codes over here. Okay, go to storyboard again. So we are back at storyboard. I need the assistant editor to help me. So okay, I need to hide the left panel. 
and over here uh, I need to edit not the .m file but the header file .h file I need to go to menu and view control .h okay so now I need this outlet to be hooked up so let me call it as label info and I need an action for this button to hook it up set it a right click and click here drag it over here and it's an outlet I want it to be an action uh, we call it hello press and connect take a look at this this it says this file has been generated automatically by Visual Studio to mirror the C sharp types changes in these files will be synchronized back to C sharp okay so let's go back to Visual Studio and take a look at what they have changed Okay, I'm over here. Let's take a look. View controller designer.cs. Yep. All the codes are here. The, the label, the hello press, and to implement it, go to view controller cs. <clears throat> I'm gonna add a code. Hello press. The, the auto print print will help you and I have a console dot right line hello press okay let's stop the previous one and run it again So we see our same interface over here and when I press hello I have a printout hello press so this code is working how about if I press hello I want the label to change we can do this now okay our label name is label info dot string value equal hello it was press so okay let's run it we have a label we have a hello let's click once so hello was pressed only hello is showing but it's working okay I think the string is not long enough okay let's go back to Xcode let's change this guy to a longer string and make some changes so that we recognize that I change it save it quit it and how about okay let's do a long text see whether it works okay let's run it again and press once so it does works but there's a string limit okay so that's all for this tutorial thank you for joining me see you again next time bye bye